What's good y'all? This is from Brazil with Love and I'm here with a customizing video. Um, I was just hanging up these uh, these box figures up on my wall. Uh, I have a couple transformers up there and these really nifty uh, Yu Yu Hakusho figures from back in the day. Uh, these are awesome. I'm, I was really debating whether I should open these or not. I decided not yet. Um, so we have I have the first series uh, there's Yusuke and see I have all four of them and but there's this little empty space here now there's gonna be a figure going here which is the um, elusive Joker figure I believe this is from the original printing of it before they re-released all of them um, now they are it isn't worth anymore but I actually hunted this figure down um, I know a couple people Felt stupid for doing it. I think my boy Century Productions, one of them. I had to hunt this guy down, and I found him in a little little town here in Brazil. And I was so psyched, man, because you know, like everywhere I went, I looked for him, and he was just on the ground. Like I was like, oh, dude, it was the last one. I saw this in Rio de Janeiro for like a hundred and forty hats, which is like eighty bucks. But you know, I paid like I think thirty dollars for it. Um, which is still expensive because you can get them for like 15 now, but you know, at the time, I, you know, I'm basing it on this and it's pretty cool. This, I mean, this isn't like what most people have. I mean, stuff written in Portuguese in here and shit, so I think that's cool. Um, anyway, what I'm going to be fixing today, it, it's not really customizing a figure itself. We're going to well, fix a box. The last video, I, was, I fixed my mummy and I'm going to fix this box. As you can see, the little tag, or whatever this is called, the hook that hangs up is is cut it's ripped you know um, this is how I got it at the store so I'm gonna try to fix that today so what I've done so far is uh, these old uh, spawn boxes like you guys have legends and shit I, I open it with a razor so I could keep these little little bowls and what I use I use these as palettes for when I paint um, I keep the fronts and the backs so I have a, I have man I have like so many of these so I mean I am gonna trash them eventually but um, you could pretty much, you know, use it before you trash it, but, you know, get some use out of it. So what I did is, pretty simple, you put one of these on top of here. Uh, you get a pen like this. This is a dry erase pen for writing on uh, boards like teachers do. And I put it on top of here, and then I trace out the rectangle, just the right size. Then, next up, so I have just a rectangle, I take one of these card backs or just pretty much anything that has this hook on it here then I take the square and I put it on top and as you can see I already did it I trace out the hook so then you have this okay then you cut it out um, as you can see here this is what I cut from it's dirty but since it's dry erase all you gotta do is just clean it up and what you get at the end of the whole process is something like this. Look at that. A, you know, it looks brand new. Um, so now, what I'm going to do is, if I put it on top of the existing one, um, I'm here. Bastard. it's going to look weird because it's going to double up and then you're probably going to be able to tell. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to cut it right here. Um, so that you know when it bends it's going to still be in, in the behind the card and then glue it here and force it forward um, I can't do that on camera I do have the glue here uh, just pretty much super glue is what I'm going to use um, anything that you could adhere plastic to plastic um, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to glue this and when I do my update video because I have um, updated my collection and not really updated, but uh, redid. I moved a lot of stuff around. Um, I'm gonna do a, a update. So when I do that, I'll show you guys the Joker on the wall. So that's from Brazil with Love with a quick, just you know, just a tip for you guys. Um, hope it helps. Um, be safe.